Alright, so we have our oven with our ribs today. And I think they actually are ready to flip. This grill method we did is technically we already cooked it. We already boiled it on the water, on the stove, for about 40 minutes. And then we put on the sauce. Beautiful baby, the ribs. We're gonna like this to just grill like two minutes on each side. What we are trying to do re really here is simply to caramel caramel uh, caramelize the barbecue sauce so that it will have that nice flavor. So yeah. Alright. So let's flip this. Rips. Oh, look at that nice fur mark. We love it. So next, what are we gonna do? We're just gonna cold a little more, more barbecue sauce. We got this honey barbecue sauce. cold layer of barbecue sauce we don't want it to be as caramelized as the first one we kind of want it to be not dry we want it just kind of saucy so it's gonna just be a few seconds <laughs> before all this is clean we don't have to worry about put the meat straight into the tray all right. that's the work again oh yeah Ooh, look at that bubbles look at that sizzling and that nice color of brown trying to Fire off. And then turn the gas off. And then turn the main the tray. And we are ready to go home and enjoy this. Alright, we have arrived home with our rips. We're gonna cut it and eat it so let's see how it, go, go, how it, wor how it works all right it was very easy to cut through let's do this mm, let's just look at this mm. all right Mmm, perfect texture. The barbecue sauce has has nice, nicely caramelized, sticky on our hand. Mmm, very flavorful. So we we put we cook this with 
the last of seasoning. We have um, we have um, we have salt, pepper. We have um, um, mustard, and we have barbecue sauce. On top of that, we have um, the key ingredients, secret ingredients: smoked paprika, along with uh, chili powder. So yeah, and along with a little bit other stuff. <coughs> I don't remember exactly. Oh yeah, I think. There's one spicy powder thing. What's it called? It's the spi spicy red. It's kind of like chili pepper. Not chili pepper. There's one of the spicy powder thing that you usually will put into with um, like fried food or other food if you want to make it spicy. I don't remember this. Oh, cayenne pepper. That's why it's called cayenne. So yeah. Anyways, can't get any better than this.